everybody, we're Gator Handicapping Thoroughbred Racing on Sunday afternoon, March the 4th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle East Coast Racing Report. Let's go to the Big A Aqueduct first for race 2, 12.52 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a 8.3 furlong route test. That's a mile and 70 yards on Aqueduct's winterized inner dirt track. Phillies and mares, four years old and up, race for an optional claiming prize of some $67,000. Tenders number one, Fantasy of Flight. Number four, Royal Sighting. Number five, Nefertini. And number two, That's Cool. Number one, Fantasy of Flight has hit the board in each of her four career starts to date with three of those efforts, including a maiden-breaking maiden win in her first asking, also qualifying as power runs. Number four, Royal Sighting, five to one on the morning line, takes a slight class drop, has turned in power run performances facing better company in each of her last four starts. Race 2 summary, number 1, Fantasy of Flight, tops my contenders list today, which also includes number 4, Royal Sighting, number 5, Nefertini, and number 2, That's Cool, 1452 in the second from the Big A. Gulfstream Park, race 10, 535 p.m. Eastern post time. This is the Lady Turf Sprint Stakes, 5 furlong sprint on the turf. Phillies and mares, 4 years old, and up racing for a stakes prize of some Seventy thousand dollars. Contenders number eleven of Fleet Lass, number nine Jenny So Great, number two Broken Dreams, and number five Suzona. Number eleven of Fleet Lass has hit the board in each of her last five, including four straight circle trip results in her last four outings. Jockey Johnny Velasquez and trainer Todd Pletcher send her to the post for the Sunday feature. They fit the board with fifty-seven percent of more than three hundred and seventy-five entries saddled as a team to date. Number nine, Jenny, so great, an eight to one shot. The overall speed leader in this stakes field has turned in power run performances in five straight, winning in her third race back. Race 10 summary, number 11 of Fleet Last, tops my contenders list today, which also includes number nine, Jenny, so great, number two, Broken Dreams, and number five, Suzona. That's 11, nine, two, five, in the 10th from Gulfstream Park, the $70,000 ladies turf sprint stakes bonus long shots turf paradise race two the speed honors in this claiming field are shared by a pair of trackmaster plus power pony qualifiers number five one more halos nine to two and number seven miss juliar four to one mountaineer park race seven number six spirit wood a five to one shot drops in class by five units the overall speed leader in this claiming field racing at today's distance of a mile on the dirt. So handicapping from both Aqueduct and Gulfstream Park on a Sunday afternoon. Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.